Nothing about them was hidden from him before he created them. Nothing about them was hidden from him before he created them. And he knew everything they would do before he created them. So any creature that Allah Azza wa created, nothing was hidden from him even before creating them. So everything is open. Everything is known. Can we expect that Allah Azza doesn't know what we do except after we do? Because these are the group of people that were saying that Allah is just, Allah is fair. He cannot punish us for things he preordained on us. Well, Allah Azza wa Jal said here, nothing, not Allah Azza wa Jal, here, here the, the uh, Aqidah statement says, nothing was hidden from him about them. Everything was obvious. He knew everything about them. Allah knows what happened. What will happen? And what did not happen? If it were to happen, how it would happen? Allah knows what it happened, what has happened. What will happen? And what did not happen? If it happens, how it will happen? So Allah has absolute knowledge. So we cannot think that Allah did not know or doesn't know things. That will happen because this is imperfection and Allah is perfect. If they were returned to this world, they would certainly commit again what they have been forbidden. And that's part of his knowledge. Because they will say, Oh Allah, return us to this life and we will do good. Allah said, if they were returned to this world, they will do the same. They will commit the same sins. So out of his knowledge. That they are going to do the bad, Allah Azza wa Jal has created them, allowed them to do the bad, and then finished, ended their life, gave them the opportunity to show that they are going to do the bad. So when He punishes them, He has the uh, He has given them all the opportunity to do good, but they did, they chose not to. If Allah knows what happens, when it happens. Then what is the difference between our knowledge and his knowledge? And these are the Qadriya. The Qadriya say that Allah knows what will happen only after it happens. Otherwise Allah forced it to happen. If Allah Azza wa Jal preordained that we are going to commit a sin, then we are forced. But Allah Azza wa Jal is just. We are not forced. And Allah does not know anything except after it happens. If we believe that, like the Qadriya, meaning that we are putting imperfection in the knowledge of Allah. So Allah knew what happened, what will happen before even it happens. 